Harry is urged make it up to Queen at Christmas. Queen casts doubt over missing Harry at this Christmas. Harry and Meghan Markle stepped back as working members of the royal family in January 2020. They have since spoken about difficulties they faced during their time in the institution, and stated it had a negative impact on their mental health. Harry has returned twice to the UK since leaving for the US, once for the funeral of the late Prince Philip, and again for the unveiling of the statue of his late mother, Princess Diana. Meghan Markle is yet to return to the UK since the move, and no member of the royal family has met the couple's youngest child, Lilibet Diana Mountbatten-Windsor. Royal expert Angela Levin has discussed the relationship between the Duke of Sussex and the Queen. She said, it's been awful but I think what she will miss is Harry and Meghan. Maybe not so much Meghan, but certainly Harry. She adored Harry and he adored her. They have a very similar sense of humor and they would do practical jokes on each other. They would do jokes like they did at the Olympics in 2012, where they came down from a plane. She added, I think she will miss that, I hope that people can make it up to her. I think in a way it's more painful than Prince Philip. Of course she missed him because it was a long time, but he was four months short of his 100th birthday. In a way you're slightly prepared, even though the reality is very painful. Prince Philip died aged 99 in April this year at Windsor Castle. Recently, the Queen has announced that the traditional royal Christmas will be held at Windsor Castle instead of Sandringham for the second year in a row. Plans were changed amid fears over a spike in Covid cases. After careful consideration the monarch will remain at Windsor Castle for the festive period and will be visited by family members there, a royal source revealed. Instead of Sandringham, the Queen, who last week cancelled her pre-Christmas lunch for the second year in a row, will spend Christmas once again at Windsor. Prince Charles' mother will reportedly be joined by members of the royal family there. This Christmas marks Her Majesty's first Christmas without her beloved husband Prince Philip who passed away in April. The royal couple spent their final Christmas together at Windsor last year. In her 2020 Christmas broadcast, the Queen noted that for many, this time of year will be tinged with sadness, she said, some mourning the loss of those dear to them, and others missing friends and family members distanced for safety, when all they'd really want for Christmas is a simple hug or a squeeze of the hand. If you are among them, you are not alone, and let me assure you of my thoughts and prayers. The Queen added, the Bible tells how a star appeared in the sky, its light guiding the shepherds and wise men to the scene of Jesus' birth. Let the light of Christmas, the spirit of selflessness, love and above all hope, guide us in the times ahead.